Nicole Scott here for Mobile Geeks, and here I'm taking a look at two detachable laptops. Here we have the Acer Switch 5, here we have the Acer Switch 3. This is a 12-inch unit, this is 12.2. The biggest difference is the 5 is the high-end. This one's running a Celeron processor, it has a full HD display, and then over here we have a 2160 by 1440 up to Core i7, also i5. This one also tops out at 8GB of RAM, this one only 4. But form factor wise, they're, they're very similar. They both have this kind of signature switch hinge here. Now we're gonna listen to that. Ooh, very solid sounding. Now let's open it. Oh, it's so difficult to open because it's such a firm hinge. Take a look at that. It kind of goes back and forth, nice and stiff. Um, I kind of thought originally that it would have like a, like levels that it clicked into, but it doesn't. It's just got these, just this really kind of like single frame that just feels very sturdy but then snaps shut. So taking a look at the five, we do have a five megapixel webcam on the back. This one's in the corner. And then the, then the Switch 3 actually has this one in the middle. When it comes to ports, we have a USB type C, full size USB, micro SD card reader, and then I believe that is the PSU, that's the headphone jack all around there. Now if we take a look at the Switch 5, very similar headphone jack, USB 3, Type-C, and the PSU. So now these also have magnetic docks, they snap right in and kind of tilt it up. And then you have this really nice angle for typing. So now when you're typing you have a really good kind of angle there. We have a pen fitted in around the side. Now if we just take a look at how well this performs. Very nice and smooth, very good tip on here. So this was just a very quick hands-on with the Acer Switch 5, as well as the lower-end Switch 3. I'm your host, Nicole Scott, for Mobile Geeks.